Hello everybody, welcome back to another video here on the channel. My name is Voidrupper here today and guys, welcome back to another video here explaining how to install custom sounds into your GTA 5. Now this does apply to 5M as well and this is going to just apply to everything in general. So this will work for your 5M and also for, you know, maybe your LSPDFR or maybe just in general GTA 5 story mode. I will say one thing though, if you do try to use custom sounds on your GTA Online when if you're a PC user, um, don't do it because it's not going to let you join. It will not let you join because it's like you have a modded version of it, please uninstall it or you're going to get permanently banned. So I I do not suggest doing this to your actual GTA 5 directory if you are a GTA 5 online user. But so guys, basically what you're going to do is you're going to want to hit the link down in the description down below to this beautiful sound overhaul pack that I've uh, found for you guys so you guys can download it. So basically what you do is you hit download right here and I'm not going to hit download because I already have this downloaded as you can see. So when that is downloaded, what you're going to want to do is basically close out of your web browser because you're all done with that one. So basically. For myself, what we're going to want to do is basically we are going to want to find our GTA 5 directory. And if you guys remember how to do that, you go to your Steam file and you go to your library. And you're going to want to hit home, go to your library, and the next thing you're going to do is go to your GTA 5, hit your scroll wheel, hit properties, and go down to local files and hit browse. And that will be, Drake, and this will take you to your Grand Theft Auto 5. And this is actually my 5M folder, so basically I'm going to show you guys how to basically install it directly into your 5M. This is the 5M GTA 5 version I use. I have another version right up here that's called LSPDFR because I, for the LSPDFR videos, I go in here and here is all my LSPDFR stuff. That is what I use for LSPDFR. This is what I have in for 5M, so I basically will switch them out. But what you're going to want to do next is you're going to want to hit times 64 right here. So go into there, and then you're going to want to click audio, SFX, and leave it open right here. And I will show you guys what I mean by this here in a couple seconds. So what we're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to right click on your file explorer or if not you can just open the uh, file you downloaded on your browser if you still have that open and you're going to want to go to your downloads folder and you're going to want to go to the Valentino sound overhaul version 4.0 this is a very good sound file because I like the way the weapons sound and also the sirens are pretty good too I'm not going to be using the sirens in this tutorial but I will show you guys how to install a siren file it's the exact same way so basically what you want to do is you're going to double click the sound overhaul and you're going to have these things right here we're going to be installing the vehicles and the weapons because i'm very excited to use this i have not actually used this in general but i will show you guys when we get into game but i'm going to show you another another siren that uh oceanside rp has on uh their website and that's what we uh as members are allowed to use but for myself, I'm going to be using another siren that uh, a member of Oceanside RP has. So I'm going to be able to show that off for you guys as well. And you guys can hear um, a very decent siren that I really found to love, as well as some other sirens as well to show you guys that are really good. So basically, when you have this open, you're going to want it to basically highlight all four if you want to install all four uh, into your GTA 5 but for myself I'm only gonna do these three files because that's what I'm doing if you want to install the siren as well go ahead and install the siren in general but what you're gonna want to do is open the file explorer again and basically drag and drop these files that you have selected in there and, you're gonna, and it's gonna ask you to replace so make sure to replace your files do not highlight the readme do not do that because it's not going to work. The README is just a text file. It just tells you what to do. So don't do the README. But if you want to install the siren as well, go ahead and install the siren there as well. So after you drag and dropped everything into your folder, you're going to want to hit X out of it. So after that, everybody, you are basically have installed everything with GTA 5. So congratulations. You have now installed custom weapons, custom sounds to your GTA 5. Uh, main directory. So I hope you guys uh, had fun with that and let's get right into the version what we're all worried about is the in-game portion and I will show you guys everything and the reason why I am using the siren pack that I am using. 
Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are now in the game, and I got us into a secluded area so we could do some stuff. So basically what we're going to do is we're going to start it out with the weapon portion so I can show you guys uh, the weapon. So I have my actual loadout that I use every day on patrol um, with Oceanside out. So basically what I'm going to show you guys is the weapon sounds that I use and my favorite sounds with this sound pack. And I will show you guys that in a complete second. So here is your combat pistol, the pistol that you're probably going to end up using on patrol in general. As I will shut up for a second so you guys can listen. Very, very nice. I love it. It's a very, very nice sound. So now we're going to move on into the, basically your rifle on duty. Like there. Very nice. And then we'll go into your shotgun. Beautiful. So now what we're going to do is we're going to basically go into our weapons and we're going to basically remove all of our weapons because I want to show you guys a couple more weapons that are very, very nice. And we're going to start with the micro SMG and I will show you guys why I like this weapon in about two seconds. So yes, it is a very nice kind of like a little spit type of thing and also the echoing sound makes it sound absolutely amazing. And now we'll go ahead and we'll put in maybe a grenade or something and we will throw that over here. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Love it. It sounds amazing. So, yeah, that's one of the big things with this mod in general. Just very, very nice. Sounds amazing um, with the weapon pack. I really, really like it, especially I love the combat pistol and the micro SMG because it just, it sounds like a spit. It's just like, D -d 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 -d. it's kind of one of those things. Sounds amazing. I love it. Thank you. 